but let's just do it. Hope for the best. Here we go. Yes. Can't get you out of my. How's it going everybody, Dreguest here, and welcome back to some more Just Cause 3. So for this episode, I did dab into a bit of modding finally. I was actually intentionally waiting because a lot of the mods early on were not really that good, and that's to be expected when a new game comes out with a new modding community. But now there's some decent ones coming out, some that are actually going to help me personally, and then some are just going to be entertaining for you guys as well as myself. The first one I got is a grappling hook mod that can essentially attach to pretty much anything. Unfortunately, I can't go all the way to that mountain way back there as you can see but like way up here for example I totally just grapple all the way to it and this is just more for traveling for myself uh, as this map is so damn big and I have to get to certain places sometimes especially when I'm looking for Easter eggs or whatnot this just helps me a whole lot and traveling really really fast now the mod that I did want to show you guys is what we're gonna see in a second here Okay, so I did also unlock the full game, uh, only because I'm going to focus more on modding and easter eggs and whatnot for this series, not really on the actual storyline, and I'm sure most of you don't care about the Just Cause 3 storyline. Anyways, realistically, who the hell does? Regardless, though, I do want to show you the vehicle that I did get. Now, this is a monster truck. This is actually in the game. This is not just it, but when we spawn it in here, you will see what I'm talking about. And should be coming any time now. Pop goes the weasel. There is the monster truck that I'm talking about. This is a monster truck with wings of all things. Now this is going to be really fun because I actually haven't really driven the monster truck too much to begin with. But now we got one with wings. It, it, there's a few little visual glitches as you can see. We got some holes in the wings, but they do work just like wings. So let's get in here and see if we can fly. Oh my god, it goes with the door? That's hilarious. But yes, I'm just going to see if I can take off here. I'm told you can't really do it on a straight line. You actually need to be falling. Uh, it's more of a glider than a plane, I would say. But I am getting so much lift, I can't even turn it anymore. Let's turn on the nitrous here and see if we can take off. <laughs> it's, it's almost doing it. It just needs a little bit more of a boost. And it might be able to do it. Holy shit. Actually, now I'm just curious because I learned something. These wings don't, in fact, clip with anything. Now, that's actually a good thing. I'm just curious, is this going to be able to fit into the cargo plane possibly? Is it big enough to store a monster truck? Because if we could take out, out of a cargo plane, or sorry, take off out of a cargo plane, that would be awesome. Okay, this runway I think should be big enough for the cargo plane, I'm hoping. I, again, this thing is huge. It's hard to really understand how big this thing is until you see it. So let's request that drop, throw that beacon, and uh, stand back because this thing's a doozy. Okay, wow, of course it is sideways once again. Is this thing ever going to be straight for me? That would be great. Uh, but no, we're just going to turn this around a little bit. This is going to be fun. You don't truly understand how big this plane is until you see a fucking monster truck <laughs> beside it. Look how small that thing is. Oh my god, this is great. I, th I think it is seriously going to fit in this. Okay, it is all set up. I'm going to be so sad if this thing doesn't fit. It looks like it seriously will. Uh, which makes me extremely excited because we might be able to actually use the cargo plane for something. Oh yeah, this thing is, it's so big, like you don't truly understand how big this thing is until you have a monster truck. God damn it, I'm not very good at driving, am I? Until you have a monster truck backing up into it effortless, effortlessly. Okay, we're, we're not putting anything else in here right now. This isn't a cargo plane episode. We just need to get this monster truck high so we can actually try and fly with it. Okay, we got our cargo. Everything is good to go. This runway should be more than big enough. Oh my god, this thing flies so damn quickly. Wow, that took off right away. I, I'm assuming that has to do with me upgrading my character as well. So yes, we do in fact, you can actually see the monster truck in there. It's totally fine, so we're just gonna go really high right now, and then drop out with a fucking monster truck. Okay, we are pretty damn high up here. Let's actually get out of this. Oh shit, 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 shit. No! No! <laughs> I almost lost my plate again. I keep getting out the wrong damn way. It's, it's definitely not safe having the only entrance to the cargo bay back here. You probably can get in some way from the cockpit, I just don't know how. Anyways, let's go inside, make sure our cargo's okay. It's looking like, oh, it is totally fine. Look at that beautiful thing. I can't get over there. Come on, get down. I'm actually really nervous about a plane flying on autopilot right now with me in the back of it. Okay, but let's open up that door and see that beautiful view. 
There we go. Look at that. We are really high up. Oh my god, I'm so pumped for this. Let's, um... Did I, I didn't activate the door. I'm trying to get in the vehicle right now. There we go. And inside we go. This is going to be officially the first thing we successfully has have really put out the back of a cargo plane. So I'm really excited for this. Let's get going, I guess. What the fuck? No! What is going on? Is, is it... <laughs> Are the wings keeping me from getting out of the fucking plane? Just let me out, please! <laughs> Alright, that was not as majestic as I wanted it to be, but we got out of the damn plane. Alright, let's see if we can... <laughs> can't believe that I couldn't get out of the plane because I'm assuming the lift from the wings were keeping me on top of the damn cargo bay. That's hilarious and we're <laughs> and we're not really flying right now. Let me see if I give it some gas if I can control it a little bit here. Oh yeah, that's uh, that's not too bad. It's a, it's kind of I mean it's more falling than flying. I got to be honest right now, but it does feel like I'm kind of getting a bit of wind on, under those wings. Oh yeah, you can definitely see it now. We are definitely gliding. It's not the most majestic of planes. It's extremely hard to control as well, but it does glide pretty damn well, I gotta be honest, until you get too top-heavy and do that. But let me see if I can even it out here. Boost it. There we go. All right. I don't, I don't want to hit the ground yet. I don't want to hit the ground yet. No, it's not really working that well. God damn it. But regardless, we're totally fine, and as you can see, we're on the ground. Let's see. If, I wonder if I can, like, boost up a hill like this and then kind of fly over a vehicle. <laughs> yes. This is great. This is just fun to use. It's great because the faster you go, the less you can churn with this thing. So it's basically death on wheels. <laughs> and it's really hard to take this thing off from the ground, that's for sure. Okay, but where I really want to go with this and where a glider should do well is at the top of a mountain. So we're going to go straight to the top here. Hopefully I can call in another monster truck somewhere up here. Because I want to see if it can go all the way down without hitting anything. That, that, that would be what I would consider to be a good glider. If I can go down a mountain, not hit it, and survive at the bottom. Okay, so we are officially at the top of the world here. And there's a nice flat spot at the top. I didn't even know that. So how convenient. Let's spawn in a car here and see what happens. All right, it's yellow this time. Look at that flames. That is beautiful. Now, I wonder which side we can, should go down. I don't know what's over here. I do know what's over there, but we are so high up, it doesn't even freaking matter. Let's actually turn around, though. And come down the same side we came up. So I'm going to get a bit of a run at it. Because I do want to get away from the cliff face. That way, you know, we can glide all the way down. So that should be good right there. Let's just do it. Hope for the best. Here we go. Yes. It's kind of working. I can feel it. Oh my god, this is great. So, th so the only problem is it doesn't have any turning. The only turning you can do is with the wheels. And then it kind of just changes your aerodynamics and turns you a little bit. But aside from that, it's all based on just the wings and that's it. So we're going down here, but we are definitely good. Like, we are so far away from this mountain now. This is definitely, I mean, you can't really argue. This is gliding more than it is falling. I'm actually curious to see how far we can go now. What the hell? Is that a jet? It is. <laughs> okay. I didn't expect to see someone else up here. Don't mind me. I'm just in a fucking monster truck. No big deal. Okay, a bit wobbly, but it looks like we're reaching the end here. I just want to see if I can land it, like, perfectly on this road. Don't think it's going to happen just because it's so hard to steer, but we might get lucky here. Come on. Oh, my God. This this, this might be good. We, we might actually land it. Fucking perfect. Look at that. Right on the road. And let's see how far we made it. So there is the actual mountain way up over there. That's where we started, right at the peak, and came all the way down over here. I got to say... That's a pretty damn good glider for a, for a monster truck. Anyways, guys, we're going to end this one here. I know it was a bit of a shorter one. I kind of want to stick to maybe one or two mods every one of these mod spotlights videos. Let me know what you think, or should I just, like, bundle a bunch together and do a 20-minute video? I know a lot of you guys like watching these 20-minute videos, but you got to realize if I do that, that means there's less time between episodes. So either shorter episodes that are more common or one long episode every one or two weeks, for example. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Anyways, guys, as always, thanks so much for your support. Thanks for watching and liking, and I will see you in the next one.